Hi everyone, you've reached Rico's channel and this is Rico. In today's video, I'm going to be talking about and showing you signs that your bird may be hormonal. Hormonal behavior may occur once or twice a year. However, for captive birds, this can turn into chronic hormonal behavior, which happens all year round. Here are signs and behaviors that your bird may be hormonal and how to help your bird during this time. Most of these apply to all birds in general, however one or two are specifically a behavior ringneck parrots do. Increased screaming outside of the norm may be a good sign that your bird is hormonal if other behaviors indicate this as well. Be sure to rule out any other issues such as health related that may be causing your bird to be screaming excessively. Touch it. <laughs> you bad boy. A bird who suddenly becomes territorial or aggressive over a cage, a specific spot in the room, toy, you or a family member is also a good indication that your bird is hormonal. During mating season, some owners have noticed their birds overprinting themselves and even feather plucking. In many cases, this is considered normal. To be on the safe side, it is best to always have your bird looked at by an avian vet to rule out any other possibilities. A female bird who lays eggs is a definite sign that she is hormonal. Could you help yourself to the broccoli? A parrot whose appetite has increased is also another sign your bird may be hormonal. Come here. Come here. <laughs> you come here right now, you bad boy. What are you doing back there? What are you doing? Peekaboo! No peekaboo. You get out of there. Okay? No dark spots. Nope. During mating season, you may notice your bird exhibiting nesting behavior, which can occur in different ways such as paper shredding, boring in fabrics, and looking for dark spaces like cupboards. This may all be a good indication that your bird is hormonal and wanting to build a nest. Another sign that your bird may be hormonal, if exhibiting other hormonal behaviors as well, is their droppings get larger and looser. They may even hold their droppings overnight until morning when they get out of their cage, especially if your bird is looking at the cage as a nesting spot. A bird who is normally sweet and tame but suddenly becomes aggressive including biting is also another sure sign they are hormonal. A bird may try to self-stimulate themselves with either their toys, objects, or you. This is a clear sign that they are hormonal. Another sign that your bird may be hormonal and wanting to mate is they will regurgitate food to either you their favorite toy, mirror, or someone else. A female ringneck parrot who may be hormonal will tilt her head back or side to side and do what's called the clucking sound while lifting her vent and eye pinning in one spot, either when being touched or cuddled.
A male ringneck parrot who may be hormonal will show off by flirting with either a hop, a strut, while doing what's called the heart-shaped wings and eye pinning to either a toy, a mirror, or yourself. Hormonal bird behaviors are normal but can become excessive and dangerous, especially egg laying with female birds. If you have noticed your bird engaging in hormonal behaviors, here are four ways to help minimize them. Remove all areas that your bird has become territorial over and may be seeking as a nesting spot, like dark spots, boxes, and shelves. Also, if you notice your bird becoming hormonal towards a certain toy or a mirror, best to remove these as well. If your bird is exhibiting these behaviors towards you, just try to distract them from this behavior. Instead, encourage your bird to play and fly more to burn off energy. Keeping your bird active can really help during this time. A rich diet can trigger your bird to become hormonal. If you notice that your bird is engaging in hormonal behavior, cut back on things like nuts, seeds, starchy foods, breads, corn, potato, beans, and meats. If you are feeding pellets, go with a good brand. Also, take away all warm and mushy foods. Instead, stick to fresh uncooked vegetables and leafy greens. Reduce sugary fruits and just feed fruits that are less in sugar like berries. If your bird is showing signs of being hormonal, be sure to allow your bird to have 12 to 14 hours of undisturbed sleep in the dark. Too much daylight will stimulate the hormones, including artificial light. Cuddling your bird or petting him outside of his neck and feet will trigger him to become hormonal. A general rule is to only pet a bird's head. Hormonal season can be a difficult time for both parrots and a parrot owner, but hopefully after watching this video, you have a better understanding of the different kinds of hormonal signs, behaviors, and how to help your parrot during this time. If you did find this video helpful, please don't forget to give us a big thumbs up, subscribe, and turn on your notification bell for future videos. As well, if you have any questions, please leave me a comment and I'll do my best to help you out. And thanks so much for watching. Say bye Rico. Love you guys. Bye for now.